Hey guys, let's talk about comma oak idiom. So let's say there is a fruits map which is going to have string as a key and integer as a value. Let's say banana, let's say three of them, and apple, two of them. You got to fix here. So if we want to know a key exists in the map, that's where we, comma, we use the comma oak idiom. So let's say value and the oak. Oak is going to get the boolean. And we say fruit. And if we say banana, then we will be, yeah, let's let's actually print it to screen. Let's run it. As you can see, the value is three, which is there. And uh, this is the boolean value, which is going to be true because the banana is already in the map. So if we say something like kiwi, for example, guess what is going to be? We got to take it like that and run it. This time, the v is 0, which is the default 0 value. And the boolean value is the false. That's how we need to actually check if the key is existing in the map or not.